The Olympus OmniScan SX is capable of conventional A-scan inspections and advanced phased array and TOFT inspections where data is saved for analysis and reporting to replace radiography. In flaw detector mode, for conventional UT probes, a large high-resolution touchscreen display and interactive menus on the A-scan allow manipulation using the touchscreen. UT Start, UT Range, Gate Manipulation, Ability to Change the Gain, and Trigonometry Readings. In conventional UT inspection, the probe is rastered in and out from the weld with overlap while observing the A-scan display for indications. Indications are marked on the weld when detected and statistical information written on the inspection report. The end result is a paper report signed by the inspector for which the results are greatly dependent on skill and experience. Phased array inspection provides a more thorough and faster inspection by use of multiple element programmable probes and scanners. Phased array inspections are regulated by the same codes and acceptance standards used in conventional UT such as ASME, EN, and similar. The probe is scanned parallel to the weld line from a predetermined position and the data is recorded. At the end of the acquisition, the data file is saved and recorded to the SDHC card for analysis directly on the OmniScan or offline using OmniPC software. Analysis includes the ability to view the data inside and in views along with the A-scan data used to create them directly from the interactive title bar. Set data cursor by a touch and hold on the touch screen or manipulating the interactive title bar allows the inspection to be replayed one data point at a time along the weld line. Length sizing is accomplished on the C-scan by placing cursors at the flaw extremities, at the three or six dB drop, depth and height sizing is accomplished on the S scan by manipulating cursors to the flaw extremities. We have a sidewall lack of fusion indication, 17.34 millimeters in length and 4.84 millimeters in height at a depth of 6.79 millimeters deep. Flaws are added to the indication table directly from the touch screen, including a screenshot of the current layout and an onboard report generator allows the OmniScan inspection parameters information about the instrument and inspection results. The report can be saved directly onto the SDHC card and printed. The Toft inspection technique uses two conventional probes and a single A-scan in a pitch-catch configuration. The OmniScan software wizards assist the user in the configuration of the UT and scanner. Select the AB layout from the interactive title bar and start acquisition on the instrument. Move the probes along the weld line in a slow, smooth, steady scan. Select the pause button and save the data 
to the SDHC memory card. Toft analysis is performed on the B-scan and A-scan after calibration for PCS and wedge delay. Zoom the area of interest on the B-scan and set the position of the data cursor near the flaw. Manipulating the data cursor with the rotary knob displays the A-scan for each data point on the B-scan. Just off of the flaw, set the position of the reference cursor on the lateral wave and the position of the measure cursor on the back wall. Using the touch screen, touch and hold and select wedge delay and PCS. The screen is now calibrated and the flaw is measured by the box created with the reference and measure cursors on the ultrasound and scan axes. Position the data cursors for a representative A scan using the touch and hold on the readings area Add the indication to the table and it's stored in the data file and available for the report.